all right welcome back to another hell divers weapon test video uh, uh i just woke up all right so we're gonna go ahead and get this on with so i can go back to sleep all right let's do this so today we're testing a flame dash 40 flamethrower uh, 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 <laughs> i am so tired you guys oh great there's lightning and shit around okay morning brain you know how it goes uh get the flamethrower and then we put in some work hey bugs come here i got something for you hey it's hot in here all right against the little bugs Ooh, took them out pretty easily what about this guy wow it actually did smoke him what are you doing? Alright, what about the chargers? Holy crap, it killed that charger quick. I did not expect for it to kill that charger that quick. Huh. Hey guys, let's get lit. Let's do a U first. All right, one thing about this that I can already tell, get some distance. Bob, you got a team. Oh, he's dead. There he goes. He's dead now. Oh, this thing, this shit is wiping groups out like it ain't nothing. Oh. Nope. Get lit. Oh, you trying to guard me with your little armor? That didn't work. Ha. Huh? All right, so against light armored bugs, it just cooks them. Against medium armored bugs, it cooks them. Against heavy armored bugs, it cooks them just a little slower. As you can tell by me getting uh, gold bird out of the screen. So, <laughs> yeah. Uh, now, now, this one, I'm actually curious about whether it would work on Bile Titan. It probably won't. But I know for sure it just works on all of these guys. Like, they can't do shit. Hey, guys. You can just wave this bitch around. I'm waving this bitch around, baby. Look at it. Burn. Oh. Gotta be careful, though. Yeah, waving this bitch around. Let's go. Look at that. Look at that. Like, they all cook. There's still one alive. Not for long, though. It's, the flamethrower is like actually boss right now, bro. Like, I like this shit. It's actually fun as fuck to use, too. I'm gonna start bringing this bitch out here, man. Now, the only thing with the flamethrower is you gotta be careful because I know you can't your teammates with this. Uh, and you don't want a team kill. You just piss off a bunch of people. I really am curious about that bio titan, though. Let's say let's say not get near rocks because I don't want to cook myself. I'm not get over there anymore, homie. Oh, we got the jumpers. Let's see how well it does against these guys. Alright, it melts the jumpers. That's good to know. Yeah, I see you don't want them to get too cool. Mm -hmm. Jumper That's things, bro. Oh, see you run out of ammo. Retreat! I see the jumper dudes already on my bumper. Already on my bumper. Ah, oh, get off. Okay, he's done. What's the other one? Hate these little things. Come on, you little hunter. Burn! Ah! Burn! Boy, super! Alright. He cooking, but he's still alive, though. Why are you, how are you still alive? Thank you. I was literally barbecuing this dude. He's just standing there. Yeah, so against light armor enemies and actually uh, chargers, it, it cooks them. It actually cooks your charger. You got to kind of use this like a, as an engaging tool, though. So you want to open up. You don't want to be defensive with this. You want to be offensive. As soon as they see you, you just want to get the cooking. Empty. See, you start cooking. The offensive. 
Go ahead and cook it. Even, even if they guard like this, cook them from the side. There you go. These these armor guys, their um, medium armor does protect them a little bit though. So you kind of got to move around on the side of them and attack them. You got the hunters, still a problem. The hunters are still a problem. Hate these things. Yeah, the the hunters are a problem. Like you can't kill them fast enough before they're just all on you. So the only things that will give you problems here will be the hunters because the hunters, they just straight up jump at you like. It's better off just shoot these little assholes. Fuck out of here, bro. Oh, the fuck. Oh. Excuse me. Didn't know where the fuck you came from. Hold on, homie. Yeah, them hunters, man. The the fact that they jump at you is the problem. They'll attack you and they fuck up your you aiming. And you gotta stand still. Ooh. You're not really the mobility with this thing is reduced too. All right, there we go. Yeah, so you gotta be careful with that because your mobility while you're moving, like while you're shooting, you're you're paused for a second. So there's like a two second delay where you can't really do anything. You can die, you can like do that shit. All right, against the Terminus, it actually is very, very good. Uh, it will kill the smaller trash mobs pretty easily. The medium armor enemies, will kill them too, just takes a little longer if they got medium armor on the front, you have to kind of go around the side and shoot them. Uh, but with the charger, if uh you're shooting at them when they charge you they're gonna bulldoze you like because <laughs> you can't move for like two seconds uh with the jumpers the jumpers are a problem with this gun right here you got to kind of if they're jumping all around you and trying to surround you it's going to be very hard to kill them because this doesn't kill things like instantaneously like if you was using a sickle or a breaker to kill these uh jumper guys so they'll jump at you and they'll get on top of you and it's game over from there so when it comes to the jumpers probably got to group them up in like a smaller area where they can't move as much and then you got to be a distance from them to take them out so it's better if you use this in like narrow spaces where like they can't really move around that much open spaces if they can jump around and do all the other stuff then they're gonna swamp you and beat your ass so but i'm gonna try this on the bots it actually does pretty well on the bugs like i'm actually surprised how strong it is but first of all the main thing about these guys you gotta get close to them see that's that that's the problem getting close It'll kill them fast, but Ooh, they got rockets, bro. They got rock. There's a lot of guys over here. And Ooh. yeah, so <laughs> this would be the problem with these guys is you got to actually get close to them. You get close to them, you'll cook them, though. Okay. Get the shit out of here. I don't know how fast it'll cook that guy. Not fast enough before you got that rocket off, though. Ah! Go ahead and fire. There it goes. Okay. Now let's cook them. All right. I did kill him. But the way I feel about this against these guys, it can kill them really fast. But the problem is, is they have guns. 
they're not like the terminates uh so it's very hard to actually use this weapon against these guys just because the devastators they got rockets they got shields uh they got a whole bunch of things that can kill you really quickly Now, one thing you can do is kind of get close to them. Okay, I did cook them pretty fast up close, though. So, if you get up close to them, you can actually cook them really fast. But, like I said, it's just not advised to do that. Just because it's like... They got, they got guns and they got missiles. And it's very risky to actually do that. Um, Yeah, this would be very difficult to use against these guys. Look, all, look at this. Look at, look at all these guys. Like, they all got, like, rockets and shit. Okay. See, the problem is they got rockets and they got missiles. And missiles kill you extremely fast. Ooh, that's a, ooh, that's a Hulk Devastator, bro. Ooh, look, missiles. Bro. Bro, <laughs> I don't know if I can get around this guy. Okay, let's heal up first. I want to see if I can actually kill one. You see how difficult it is, though, to get him roll. Hold on, hold on. Oh shit. Okay, let me get the fuck out of here. The missiles hit me hard, bro. Can I roast these guys like this? Oh, it actually took the walkers out pretty easily, but they gotta get close though. I tried to be slick there. Ooh. Oh, you just call up, bro. Really? I'm fast to kill these guys. Can I kill you fast enough? Okay, I actually did kill them fast. See, I got that one behind him. Let's see. And he got cooked. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, it's okay. So against the little guys, it does kill them really easily. The problem that you have on this, though, is you have your range issue. They got more range to you and their guns can kill you really easily. The rockets will take you out really freaking fast. Is that the same one? That is not the same one. It's a completely different one. And I ain't got time for you, homie. Yep, bye bye. Fuck out of here. All right. Yeah, he had a flamethrower. Oh. Uh, and I'll hell him broke loose. <laughs> what the? Are, are you serious? I can't jump over there. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Oh my god. I'm dead. Bro. So, my verdict on the flamethrower. Flamethrower is good against the terminates. Uh, if you got any of the hunters. They will swamp you pretty fast, so you need to bring a good support backpack. Probably the guard dog with the laser. Uh, or bring a shield. But I would say bring the guard dog with a laser. Just because it actually shoots things around you. If you're going to bring the flamethrower. Uh, also, you need to open up with the flamethrower. Don't play it like a defensive weapon. Play it like an offensive weapon. Against the automatons, do not bring this weapon out on the field. It's a good weapon against the terminates. But against the automaton don't do it it's bad it's not gonna end well for you uh but yeah that's pretty much all i gotta say about that but with that being said uh i'm out of here guys uh do me a big favor you can hit that like button also subscribe to the channel for more weapon stuff more video game stuff Ah, uh, i don't know if i'm gonna play dragon's dogma i thought about it but i'm probably not gonna play that um next game i'm probably gonna put on the channel is gonna be stellar blade because i saw rise of the ronin and uh, 
Dragon's Dogma. And I'm I don't know. I'm, I might play Dragon's Dogma. I'll see. But uh, with that being said, like I said, hit the like button. Also, subscribe to the channel and drop a comment. And I'm out of here.